and prevent red tide from happening. And meanwhile, many are left wondering why it's so bad this year. Yeah, and ABC Action News reporter Wendy Lane spent, spent the day trying to get that question answered and finds out who local fishermen say is actually to blame. Basically, it's a disaster zone. It's the worst red tide and fish kill in Tampa Bay since the 1970s. So far, producing more than 1 million pounds of dead fish and recently testing 10 to 17 times greater than what is considered high concentrations. This red tide that we got in Tampa Bay this year is on a whole nother level. Charter boat captain Mike Goodwine says normally bad red tide doesn't come past the Skyway into Tampa Bay. And he believes what happened at Piney Point a few months ago has everything to do with it. Now we got a mess. Back in April, the Department of Environmental Protection released 200 million gallons of nitrogen-rich water into Tampa Bay to prevent a leaking gypsum stack from collapsing. I was there. And right here is where millions of gallons of that contaminated water is coming out of that pipe and down a canal into Tampa Bay. It's about 100,000 bags of fertilizer dumped in the Tampa Bay in this one location. Fast forward three months later to now. This pipe that the Piney Point water once came out of has since been capped, but some fear its impact may just be beginning. I'm really concerned that it's going to get worse. I spoke to Justin Bloom with Suncoast Waterkeepers, who says he believes Piney Point plays a role in the severity of this red tide. But he says it's difficult to scientifically prove, and it's likely that people don't want to risk their jobs by pointing fingers. They're still analyzing. They're doing DNA analysis. And, but I don't think that there is that, that smoking gun. I'll still clearly make the connection and say that, you know, but for Piney Point, we would not be seeing the severe red tides that we are in Tampa Bay. I think that's a no-brainer, and I think most people would agree with me. Oh yes, I'm 100% sure this release made the red tide inside Tampa Bay as bad as it is now. I went into Tampa Bay on the Hillsboro side with Captain Mike and Captain William Weiss. This is where everything, all the life in the bay comes from. Well, if you kill especially this area, if this area dies, it kills the bay. I'm out in the water on the Hillsboro side of Tampa Bay, and you can actually see the red tide line. Check out that line of fish and the foam floating in the water. The fish kill wasn't as bad as it was on the Pinellas side, but we did see red fish and... Oh, no. There's no outdoor fishing. Sir, we're out here checking out the status of the red tide on Sarasota. So stay tuned. Please like, subscribe. And y'all are going to have a nice view of dead fish. Spread the word out. Stop flushing the water. This could have been anything right here. Let me see. We'll grab something. That could have been like a snook. Yep. That could have been a snook. Look, could have been. 
Birds probably ate it. Could have been a snook or a wren. See a lot of flies on the sand. It's not bad over here on Turtle Beach.
So now we're on the north side of Sarasota. This is the North Bridge. Over by Turtle Beach, it wasn't bad, but over here, as soon as you come over here on this side, it's a couple dead fish flowing around. You can't really see it. Even if I try to zoom in, you can't really see it, but there's like maybe a big fish right there. Could be a grouper or something. And you can smell a little bit. You can smell it. Look at the water. Look at the color of the water. How just dirty the water is right now. You can smell just a little bit. It's it's bad. We need to get the word out. Stop spilling the water. Stop spilling the oil. Stop. Look. Look, there you go. There's a dead fish right there. I don't know if somebody caught that or it's just from the red tie. Oh man, this is bad. You know, just this is really bad. We just need to get this word out. But yeah, doing a little little searching around. A little checking it out. Water looks very dirty. You can smell a little bit. Look at the water. Look how dirty this water is. This water was never this dirty. We're just checking every beach area, every shore and everything. Just doing a little research, a little video about the red tide status. It's bad. Everything's bad right now I'm down St. Pete, Tampa. Got the drone up. Look at this. Now we can't fish because about the red tide, you know. Now everybody that likes to vacation here can't come vacation and have fun because there's a lot of dead fish. A lot of restaurants are gonna be out of business a lot of people is going to be out of business cat is going to be out of business a lot of people are going to be out of business because about this reptile you probably have to go offshore to get away from this reptile people don't want to go offshore people just want to have fun inshore just to fish around the mangroves how catching mangroves tarpon and catch something but we can't because of right by the red tide everything's dying because of okeechobee because of that place down Tampa, I forgot the name of it, that's releasing all the water. <sighs> we gotta do something about this. And we just need to spread the word out and check it out. Well, I'm gonna keep videotaping and maybe hit down Lido and check it out. Oh man, this is bad. You and me stuck on the ocean now Nothing but waves in this villain in I wanna dry up but you Just keep on going, don't you? I don't even know how we got here All my reasoning have disappeared I wanna bury the hatchet And find the way back to our home Our home, our home We don't have to drift inside this dome I will not let us fade away It's not a price I wanna pay And it's not too late No, we lost our purpose Chasing all that surplus You were all that I need I feel that we can break free We can still go back there To a place with no cares We can turn this ship around We can turn this ship around All the way back home
could be ourselves Didn't have much but nevertheless We were true to each other But now we don't even bother I remember you being hopeful But the tall waves have worn us down And slowly we are drowning That's why you need to come with me With me, with me Turn around 180 degrees And cross the sea I will not let us fade away It's not a price I wanna pay And it's not too late No, we lost our purpose Chasing all that surplus You were all that I need I feel that we can break free We can still go back there To a place with no cares We can turn this ship around We can turn this ship around All the way back home Stuck on the ocean now Nothing but waves in this filling in I wanna dry up but you Just keep on going, don't you? I don't even know how we got here All my reasoning have disappeared I wanna bury the hatchet And find the way back to our home Our home, our home We don't have to drift Inside this dome I will not let us fade away It's not a price I wanna pay And it's not too late No, we lost our purpose Chasing all that surplus You were all that I need I feel that we can break free We can still go back there To a place with no cares We can turn this ship around We can turn this ship around All the way back home Ourselves. Didn't have much, but nevertheless We were true to each other But now we don't even bother I remember you being hopeful But the tall waves have worn us down And slowly we are drowning That's why you need to come with me With me, with me Turn around 180 degrees And cross the sea I will not let us fade away It's not a price I wanna pay And it's not too late No, we lost our purpose Chasing all that surplus You were all that I need I feel that we can break free We can still go back there To a place with no cares We can turn this ship around We can turn this ship around All the way back home
could do so many great things So believe in me, I believe in you And I just feel that this will be an upswing So hear me out No, we lost our purpose Chasing all that surplus You were all that I need I feel that we can break free We can still go back there To a place with no cares We can turn this ship around We can turn this ship around All the way back home Chasing all that need oh, oh, oh. Chasing all that need oh, oh. Chasing all that need oh, oh. All the way back home Chasing all that need oh, oh. 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 All the way back Now we made it to the other side. This is Bird Key going down the Ringling Bridge. And I'm already spotting some dead fish. Let me see if I can walk down a little bit now. There's a sheep head in there. Yeah, there's a lot of small fish. Lots of them. Look at that. Look at that. We're gonna send the drone, I mean the here the drone up. We're gonna send him up. And we're gonna look at the water. Spot a lot of dead fish on this side. There's another one right there. It's cheap head. Hey, I can smell. I can smell a little bit of the red tide. Man, this is, this is bad. There's a lot of dead fish on this side. Well, I'm going to walk all the way down there. I'm gonna walk the other side. We're gonna check it out. All right, stay tuned. You and me stuck on the ocean now. Nothing but waves in this filling in. I wanna dry up, but you just keep on going, don't you? I don't even know how we got here. All my reasoning have disappeared. I wanna bury the hatchet and find the way back to our home, our home, our home. We don't have to drift inside this dome I will not let us fade away It's not a price I wanna pay And it's not too late No, we lost our purpose Chasing all that surplus You were all that I need I feel that we can break free We can still go back there To a place with no
different spot and I'm already spotting dead fish floating. Let's see if I can get a close up look. There you go. It's all over this place. This is uh been little bridges right here down Ken Thompson. <clears throat> down Sarasota Bay. Look at this. Catfish, pinfish. It's all over here, man. Hey. Look, I literally walked from all the way over there. Oh man, this is sad. Look at this. And it just keeps going and going and going. And it gets worse and worse. <laughs> oh man. <clears throat> there you have it. That's what happens when this keep releasing that water. <sighs> it's not bad over here, but it's all coming over here. It's like it's bad. This is bad. Look at this. Look at this. Just look at this. Man. It's a dead end for me. Can't get in there. But just look. Well, you have it, guys. A red tide situation. It just won't stop releasing the water. If they don't stop releasing the water, this is what we're going to keep having. We need to spread the word. We need the word out. We need to for somebody to hear. We need somebody to hear this. We don't want to keep having this red tie. Do y'all want to keep coming fish? People that, you know, from out of town come and visit 
Sarasota, they want to come here and fish and have fun. Nope. Not when this happens. Look at this. Not when this happens. Not when you want to see fish, dead fish, flowing around. Oh, man. I know I don't want to swim in this, or I want to fish. I don't want to fish in this. Not me. We need to get the word out. You know, in the Southwest Florida over the past week, they just had thousands, I mean thousands, thousands, thousands of dead fish. Tampa had thousands of dead fish. St. Pete the same way. Everywhere, everywhere. It's bad. I mean, this is really bad, guys. Just look at this. I can't fish. I love fishing. I want to be able to fish. Look, that's an eel. Pinfish, good bait. This is nothing. It's gonna get worse. It's gonna get worse. If we don't stop this now, it's gonna get worse and worse. This is just the beginning. All this you guys are seeing right now, this is just the beginning. Trust me, it's gonna get worse because all this is coming down from Tampa, St. Pete, and they release that water from over there. From Heidi, I think it's called Heidi Point or something like that. We got the drone. Look down here, man. This is bad. And it's all out there. All out there, man. So I'm just reading right now. Paint, Painty Point. I think it's called Painty Point. That's all the way by Tampa. That's when they released the water. That's just half of the water they released. Don't forget about Okeechobee. All down there, everything in that area. How people just released the water and they really don't care where they released it. I'm just saying this is just part of the red tie. It's going to get worse and worse if we don't get the word out this is bad so look how sad it is just look at this it's nice Red snapper over there. Some mullet. Lots of pinfish. Good bait. Just saw a skeleton, half a dead, what do you call it? Snook. I have no words for this. Just look how bad they look. Just look at it. Just look. It gets worse and worse. This is nothing, like I'm, t I'm telling y'all. This is nothing. This is nothing. This is just happening. It's just sad. Can't even come down and fish like I used to. Oh, man. Those people out here fishing, bro, I don't know. I don't know, it's just sad to even look at this. There goes a puffer fish over there. Right there is a puffer fish. 
I just saw a dead snook earlier. Look at the whiting. That's a nice whiting, pinfish. <laughs> yeah. Look at this. <sighs> nice size grouper. It's a very nice size grouper right there. Good size, it's probably 25 to 26. This is really, really getting really out of control. Look at this. Like I was telling you, this is the red tie. It's gonna get worse and worse. It's a nice sized group. I was probably a red gag group. <laughs> yeah. Looks like every time we come different spots, there's more dead fish. That's the first big fish I've seen. Dang! Oh, so what you think about this? Uh, well, you know, I think this is... I'm wondering, I'm starting to wonder, a lot of this is just drifting down from the north at this point. A lot of these dead fish we're seeing. I think most of it's drifting down. As we've gone further and further north today, mm -hmm. three or four stops we've had, five stops, it's kind of gotten worse and worse. But I think, I think a lot of it's drifting this down from the Tampa. It must be drifting down from St. Pete, Tampa. Tampa area. But this is nothing, man. This is, it's going to get worse and worse. Well, it's not fully here. If it gets down here, yeah. Oh. It just comes down here. Because look at it. You tell me. It's not going to get down here? Now look. I see dead fish already. Come. Well, it would be interesting to get someone to actually test this water that's not part of, like, uh, some government agency who's telling you what, what they want to tell you that would be uh, forthcoming and honest what's actually in the water. Does it have anything to do with Piney Point or, 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 or just... Okeechobee. Or, or you know, Okeechobee, but I think this is coming from the north. I think Okeechobee can be out of this at this point. Piney Point. Okeechobee is way, way south, isn't it? Yeah. But, I mean, this... This is definitely my, what's it called, Piney Point, from all that relief. It's, 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 my throat's a little irritated. Yeah, yeah, my, my starting to, you can smell it too. Definitely got a scent. This like is the first soon, place we really had a strong scent. Yeah, because we were down, you know, we've been by where, south, right? Yeah, down south, so we were in Sarasota. Sarasota and all that. A couple different spots down there. Turtle Beach, Beach to, uh, Longboat, Longboat, uh, Bird Key. Area. And now we're over here, like close to north, like close to Tampa area. Not close, I mean, I don't know, it's, I don't know what to say. It's just look at all that over there. See all that? All the bubbles and stuff? Yeah, this, is the, this is the Ken Tom Park area. Oh, yeah. But I imagine over there. 
I imagine all the mangoes over there. Uh, that air is definitely getting. Yeah, I mean, just the air coming through here is not. It's burning my throat. Yeah. It's not horrible. I had a lot worse. But... No, it's, it's gonna get worse. All right. By the way you can look at it, it's gonna get worse. Give it a couple more weeks. We'll be out here again. We're gonna keep keep an eye on this. We're gonna check it out. I don't know what to say. There's probably nothing to say. Just get the word out. Well, it's kind of depressing. You, can't, you really can't fish. You don't know what you're going to run into. I mean, should you be fishing with this stuff in the water? Should you be in the water? I don't know. If you got cuts, I got a, you know, stuff like that, and you're in the water, and then you, you, you run into some of this. I know it's kind of spotty and it's here and there, but where is it exactly? Who the heck knows? All I have to say is just. Get the word out there. Check out Tampa Clearwater. Captains for South Clean Water. Check all that out. What's that one on Facebook? The water, uh, clean water movement. Oh, um, yeah, check it out. I think it's Captains Clean Water or something like that. There's a clean water movement on Facebook. <coughs> called South Florida Clean Water. Yeah, definitely check that out. Check them out, get the word out for them. Check it out, man. Shit, this is bad. This is bad, huh? This is bad. Really bad. Yeah, it's terrible. This ain't nothing, it's gonna be worse. <laughs> oh yeah. Well everything's coming down from Tampa. That's that's the main thing right now. Yeah. 